Welcome back, folks. We went and got some unipolar magnets last time, and now it's time to put them to use. So we want unipolar magnets. We want copper ingots, because what we are making is... If I can find it... No. These guys. Particle containers. So we need copper and unipolar magnets for that. And that's fine. So, and we're going to need a lot of lines uh, because we can only really set up, uh, well, we can, can set up 12 machines in a row, but I'm going to set up 10 machines in a row. So 10 machines in a row means that we would be producing one, well, 10 um, of these particle containers every four seconds, which means that we produce two and a half per second. So we're gonna need a lot, because we need to get up to 30 a second. Actually, we need to get up to 60 a second. We need to get up to 60 a second. Yeah. So we're gonna need a lot of this. So let's just see if we run unipolar magnets out here. Actually, no. We'll run unipolar magnets out here. We'll run copper out here and we'll run unipolar magnets out here. That'll mean... Let's just bring it out a bit. That we can set up machines here and here. Tell them to make particle containers from the alternate recipe. And autosave. And we did just finish the veins utilization one again. So now we're doing the, the logistics carry engine, which is kind of nice. And then, so we'll do that twice. And then we'll do veins utilization again. So... Our outputs are gonna go the other way, because we're gonna need so many of these, I feel, that will output into another tower. I think that makes the most sense. So, two lines of ten here would mean that we're making five a second. So, if we do input 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 and outputs then we can do one two three four five six seven eight nine ten Actually, why don't we do 12? Because that means that we're producing 6 a second, I think. If my math is right, which by no means is certain. But I think it's right. Let me know if it's right. Can you do math better than I can? You probably can. Alright, so that's six a second. And we can utilize the belt here. So we can do like 
that. And we can do copper ingots. And we can do these guys. And let's just bring them all the way down where they need to be. And we can, in fact, copy this, except the... Sorters are in a bad spot. So, let's see, how did we do? We did input, 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 and output. and output. Alright, so this will be 12 a second. So we need two more, which we can do, which is awesome. So two more of these. So we will do uh, unipolar magnets up to here, up to here, I think. Then we'll do copper ingots up to there, and we'll do unipolar magnets up to there. Okay. So you. Uh, no. You. I'm not gonna work. Ah, crap. Alright. We'll put them in manually. And input, 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 input. And output. Oh, and we need a belt here, of course. Output. And you are output. Yeah. So. So this will be 18. Once we have this line as well. And then we need three out from here, we need unipolar magnets up there. That is enough space, right? This is. And they need to come up to there. Then we need copper. needs to come up to there, 
and Puny Polar Magnets. Which needs to come up to there. Alrighty. And then we need an output line. There. And now we sh definitely should be able to take this. Yes. Good. So this will be. Uh, this won't be enough. Dang it. This will be six, twelve. 18, 24. So, I'm actually thinking... Uh... I'm actually thinking that we don't put the last two lines in and make another one because we're gonna need more anyway now nah, but we are already producing so I actually I think this is fine I think this is fine so you come in here the thing is that we're using the end product, the graviton lenses, for spacewalkers as well. So we need a little bit more than 30. But we have graviton lenses being made elsewhere as well, so that's fine. Ooh, I wonder, can I get power going into these guys in the middle? That's a good question. See, no, the ones in the middle will need to be powered by uh, regular poles. That's okay. Okay. So let's go down here. From here. Alrighty, everything is powered. Then we just need another tower. And that tower is gonna be across from that tower. Is that there? I think that's there. Let's stick you in there. And well, it doesn't matter, does it? I was thinking of putting them together on belts, but uh, so merging them, but it doesn't really do make a difference. Oh, that is not right. That's right. You need space warpers. Storage. You're gonna, gonna need these guys. And down at the other end, we actually don't need space warpers, but we do need these guys. Because, as per usual, we're gonna come up here. Start requesting some more stuff. Now, where can I request some more stuff? There. Uh, yeah, but I don't want to use that one. Uh, this one. We will request unipolar magnets and we will request copper ingots. And 
Is there anywhere else that we can? Yes. Uh, unipolar magnets. Copper ingots. Remote demand. Remote demand. Okay, we don't have copper ingots anywhere. Or did we just request them all over here? Wherever it was. Yes, we did. Alright. So we might need to set up some copper and get smelting, smelting over on our smelting planet. Which is okay. We can do that. Uh, now where was it that we set this up? Uh, it was at the end of this, wasn't it? I think it was. Yeah, there it is. Alrighty. So, this is all good. So, hopefully, we'll start making 24 a second of these very, very soon. That would be awesome. So, what's next for these guys? Well, actually, for the graviton lenses, it's diamonds. Diamonds are easy. And how many diamonds do we need for one of these? Uh, graviton lens. We need four diamonds every six seconds. So that's two every three seconds. Which means we can set up 15 machines in a row. And 15 machines in a row. So 10 machines in a row would produce 10 every 6 seconds. Which would be 5 every 3 seconds. Which is a horrible number to work with. But... Let's see, 10 every 6 seconds is 10 machines, so if we set up 15 machines, then it's 15 every 6 seconds, which is 7.5 every 3 seconds, which is 2.5 every second. So... We need four. Four lines would be ten a second, so we need eight, twelve lines of fifteen machines. Twelve lines of fifteen machines a second. Oof. Oof. So that basically means that we need three setups making those, three towers making them with four lines each. Running out of space in this planet. Mm, suppose we could make one or two here, and then yeah, I don't, I don't know. Hmm. Anything coming in yet? No. Come in, please. Oh, we have 10,000 here. We have 10,000 there. Why are you not delivering? Ah, local demand 
local demand. All right. Things are coming in. Here they are. That is unipolar magnets and copper. So how far down are we producing so far? Down to here. We should get all the way. I think. There we are. And we're down to here. Yeah, we're getting all the way. Nice. Okay. So where was the space? It was there. Basically on the other side of the planet. There. Okay. Let's stick you in there. I guess. And you are gonna want particle containers and diamonds. Uh, we, should we set the diamond production up first? I guess we should. So that's 60 machines in a row that we can have. Making 30 diamonds a second. And we need... 120 diamonds a second. So that's four rows of... 60 machines. Do we have space for that right here? No. No, we do not. We might have to do the diamond smelting elsewhere. I think we will. Where, though? If we're running out of space, uh, which is weird, because we have a lot of planets to work with. But I don't want to set it up on Mars 6. Uh, diamonds are made in smelters, right? Smelting facility. So, why don't we help head to our smelting planet? Whichever one that is. I think... It's Mars 5. Looks like Mars 5, doesn't it? Where we have our shooting gallery as well. Or it could be Mars 3. Nah, there's not enough. Uh, Mars 5. Let's head over to Mars 5 and take a look. Well, Mars 4, actually. Mars 4. Is this where we're smelting? Actually, no, it's not. It's not. Nope. Then let's try taking a look at Mars 3. Is that where we have it? It could be. I can't remember. I cannot remember. 
We're still researching, but not very fast now. Is this where we have smelting? There's a Kimberlite, Kimberlite vein, which is what we need for... No. Man, there's a lot of space here to build. We'll have to set up here as well. So Mars 3 is a good choice for our next planet expansion. It's not Mars 6. It could well be Mars 5. I think it is Mars 5, to be honest. Let's go. Yeah, it's here. I am fairly certain it's here. Oh, face plant. Yeah, there it is. We're smelting. So let's set up some more smelting here. Uh, first of all, diamonds. Diamonds are important, and apparently a girl's best friend, but they're important to me. Uh, hmm. I think I'll set up diamonds here. That might be a, be a mistake. We might need more titanium. Oh, I don't really think so. Yeah, maybe. But we have other planets where we can mine. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll set up diamonds here. Uh, power. You do not need that, though. I already said that you needed to have titanium. You need Kimberlite ore. We have quite a lot of smelters on us. But I need 60, 120. I need 280, so we don't actually have enough smelters on us. But that'll that'll be okay. Uh, let's see how we're doing power power wise. We're gonna need more power. I have my power set up down here. Wow, this is empty. What were you mining? Coal? I guess you were mining coal. Okay. Oh. We're done. Right, so here we will grab these and we'll clear that. And we'll say ten percent load. Antimatter fuel rods, and we'll get a thousand. But that's okay. And then we'll do Dyson Sphere. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's just set up all six because we are going to need a lot of power on this planet. Anti-matter fuel rods. That's one too far. And logistics. Let's get some sorters in here. There. All right. So those six will generate three hundred. 
giga or megawatts of power, which will basically double our power more or less. So that's all good. And let's see. I only have five of those left, so we'll have to do it the other way. So basically we just need a line of 60 smelters. Yeah. And we need four of them. So if we do... Kimberlite ore. We do have enough space here right now. Yeah, Lord. So three, six, nine. We need two, four, six, eight. So actually, you know what? Let's do here. I do want to filter you to Kimberlite Ore. And we want diamonds as well. There they are. Okay, then we want you to come out here. And actually, that means that you need to go away. Because I want you to come out here. <clears throat> but why? Actually, why am I doing that? Let's just let's let's try this again, shall we? We want Kimberlite ore out, and we want. Kimberlite or out. Then we want diamonds in and diamonds in. And we need some smelters. And you need to make diamonds. No, not that recipe. Diamonds. Diamonds. And you need sorter in, sorter out. Sorter in, sorter out. Okay, so that's two. Then we want... I think we'll do like this. Inbound. And Kimberlite. Out. Oh. Yeah, so that's basically you. And then we want inbound and Kimberlite. And that will basically be you. Okay. Then all we need to do is extend our belts out a lot a heck of a lot so let's do that 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 come on out of save And 
This is return. And this is return. And this is out. This is a different color for some reason. It looks like to me. Maybe it's a little hill or something. Alright. I think we need to come out a little bit more, but I guess I'll finish up this in between episodes, and then we will kick it into gear in the next one. Whoops. And start it producing. But this will be all the diamonds that we need then. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Is this enough? Two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's six. That's twenty. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40 is definitely not enough. 41, 42, 43, 44. 46, 47, 48, 49. So we need to come out like something like that, I guess. 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. So that's how long it needs to be. That is how long it needs to be. And there. And there. Oops. There. And there. Okie dokie, so I will place all the rest down in between episodes, and I'll see you next time. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.